Alright guys, it is me, Hitman, back once again with another Destiny video and today we are throwing it back to the old days of my channel where I would do Zor location and review videos and that's, that's what we're going to do today guys. We're going to throw it back, way back to 2015 and we're going to do a Zor location video. So today guys, he is in the reef where he spawns like once every five weeks or so. Um, but yeah, so he's down in the reef lurking in a corner. Let's see what he has today. I haven't seen it yet, so let's go. Okay, so he has a legacy chestplate engram. Not much point in getting that, obviously, unless you are a collector like myself, but I think I have most of the stuff from year one. But anyway, attack and not with a very nice intellect strength roll. 65 and 60 is actually pretty decent in terms of high rolls, and this is probably my favorite helmet for a titan, so I'm definitely going to pick that up. It's actually got decent standard rolls on it as well. Bonus super energy from heavy weapon kills, which is actually so handy when you're going to be running the raid. Now next is the Young Amkar Spine Gauntlets for the Hunter. Now personally, I'm not a fan of these unless I was running Trials, but I do have a much higher roll for them myself. The roll on this isn't great. It's a 72 with a max 89 on the Discipline roll on these, but I do have a higher roll one myself, so I wouldn't necessarily go buying that because it's only a middle of the road kind of roll. Next, we do have the Ram Helmet for the Warlock. Now, this is probably one of the most hated helmets ever. Back in the day in Trials of Osiris, this thing was an absolute animal. But yeah, this one's actually decent as well. 59 and 63 is okay. Uh, it's definitely one you could buy if you're really looking for something. Um, I mean, it's got pretty standard perks on it. Obviously, you can reroll it should you like something better. Now, guys, the weapon today is the Red Death. Now, Red Death is definitely one of my favorite guns available in Destiny. Definitely for Trials, it is definitely one of my favorites. And also for PvE as well, it does work uh, in things like Archon's Forge and stuff. But I already have one, so I won't be buying one. But uh, you guys can get one if you like. Like, it is an amazing weapon, and I actually have one of, one of the skins for it as well. So I'm looking forward to uh, to throwing that on as well. But anyway, I guess that is pretty much it for today. Obviously, Zor has all the other standard stuff as well. I'm going to buy some three of coins. But yeah, that is it, guys. Zor is back in the tower for today. He has some decent stuff. I would definitely advise buying the Takanaut should you need something. But that is it from me, Hitman. If you like the video, make sure you drop a like, comment, subscribe. And as always, guys, I have been Hitman, and I will see you in the next video, guys. Hitman, out. See you guys. Together we're invincible.